Uh, so my name is Charlie and I'm from Nanjing, China. I'm a freshman here at Georgetown. Well, I think because I'm just really interested in politics and international relations, so I want to come to a place where I can actually experience both the theoretical side of things but also the practical side of things. I think Georgetown also being located in DC really offers me the opportunities to do that. The people actually, because it, it might sound cliche, but there are just so many people from different backgrounds and I, I just, I'm just really interested in like, actually learning different people and also where their values and cultures are. Uh, the lack of diversity actually, but we're moving into the right direction into actually having a more equal and, and more diverse campus. Uh, I think I will have a, a more a nicer dining system because I think our dining system needs a bit more work. Uh, I think the faculty members are just so knowledgeable in the sense that they all have really experienced practical sense because most of them are from uh, the State Department, also from the DOJ, the DOD. So I think those experiences really shocked me about how how well read and also how well educated some of my faculty members are. Uh, coming from New Zealand, I did not know much about just American high school, uh, American college in general. So I think just having a better understanding of how much reading we have is probably a, a thing I would should have done a bit more st study and research in. I, we, I just think we have a really beautiful campus and the idea that um, the dorms are not as nice as it looks from outside. Uh, my high school is actually the biggest high school in New Zealand. It's, called a, it's a school called Around Into the College with 3,000 students and 200 staff members. So I think it's just like a really big school. That, that's why I think I've experienced a lot of diversity, also income equality in my school as well. And I think I really appreciate my high school in New Zealand. Exercises from the Carnegie Academy Online, also about, about a whole lot, bunch of books like the, S, the SAT official preparation books and also just all sorts of books actually to prepare for SAT. Just doing more research actually because all sorts of schools are different and every school there's only going to be to be one school that fits you. So like I always tell people that getting to a school is like getting to the right school is getting to like a, a right marriage. Like there, of course there's going to be like a more beautiful pers person out there but the, the fact that there's only going to be one person that fits you. No I did not because I was in China and the whole Amer American visa process is a bit, it's not that easy. Um, I'm majoring in international political economy. I think uh, I'm just quite interested in both the international relations side of things but also the economic side of things. From the trade war that's going on right now between China and the United States, that really shows the, in the impact of both the econo economy but, and also the <laughs> politics. So I want to have a better understanding of both of them. Uh, I want to make sure that I'm able to use my skills and experiences I learned from my international political economy major to actually create like, like it sounds, might sound cliche, but create an impact on other people's lives through working at the United Nations or working for the, the World Bank. Uh, we definitely have lots of parties, especially on Thursdays and Fridays and Saturdays. So uh, you can definitely go to any places that you want, to be honest, and there's always going to be a party there. And you don't have to um, actually uh, try really hard to actually to be accept accepted to any clubs. You can just go to the parties with your friends. Uh, there's a place outside Georgetown, it's a place called Flavio's, it's an Italian restaurant, they have really good food there. So we just had our Georgetown day last Friday, so it's like a bit, big end of year celebration, celebrating Georgetown culture and so Georgetown values, and I think that's like a big celebration that we have every, every year. Uh, every year when we graduate, we normally jump into the water fountain just down in, next to uh, the Haley Hall, and also sometimes people steal the the clock tower is actually the clock sign, so, and sometimes they give to like, the President of the United States or to the Pope. Uh, I'm, no, I'm, no, I'm normally involved in a, a few uh, financial organizations, but also I'm quite involved in politics as well. So I'm part of the Georgetown University Alumni and Student Federal Credit Union. Also, I work at the Georgetown Investment Office. And also, I'm quite involved with the geopolitics, Georgetown University Institute of Politics, and I'm like a, one of the members on the student strategy team. Uh, just, just do more research to know uh, what you're passionate about and um, what you want to do later on in your life. Just to listen to all sorts of speakers from different polit political parties and also from different parts of nations, I think that's really interesting to see different perspectives. Definitely for sure. Like and subscribe. <laughs>